Since entering the PNG National Rugby League competition, the DDSL Cup in 2019, Kimbe Cutters have established a pathway program to identify and develop local raw rugby league talents from within the province. Franchise team manager Francis Kumai said for the past three years, they have continued to invest a lot of time and resources on their current junior development pathway program, which is part of the team's vision and objective to promote and expose the up-and-coming stars for the future. Kumai made mention of PNG Hunters' new recruit Tony Warrock, Gurias Mark Alunga and Stephen Bruno, and the Tigers' Lionel Molpaya as products of Cutters' development program. We have a, a very good uh, school development program uh, that is currently uh, active in, in the province. Uh, we have that program has been going on for quite a while now. And from the players that we have uh, in the squad, and some of those players are currently with uh, the other franchise team as well. Those players has come through the, the development program. On the cutters' preparations for the upcoming season, Kumai said though they have a very young team, he is confident they will be competitive. We are expecting a good uh, challenge this, this year. We are happy with the, the standard of uh, the forwards as well. We have a lot of uh, new recruits from uh, Goroka. Uh, we have four of the uh, Goroka Lani's players who are currently with us. Uh, basically, they have been recruited in the province. Uh, we also retain the service of uh, uh, Ismail Vaine uh, from Vagitumbe. He's been with us last year, so we continue to, to retain him. Uh, also, we have uh, uh, Elijah Rotinga, uh, one of our debutants for last year from uh, Jawaka. We, we also maintain him. Uh, so far, so good. Uh, the, the training has been going well. Uh, in preparations for the 22 season. The Kimbe Cutters will kick off their season against PRK Mendimuruks in Ley on the 17th of April 2022. Terry Longwood, TV1 Sports.